From backyard to high school football, boys dream of playing the game on Saturday afternoons. College football marks a new level of competition, a process that begins with a signature signifying a commitment to the university one will pour their heart and soul into for years to come. That commitment not only joins you to your university and coaching staff, but to those who sign along with you, forming a brotherhood within your class. I think it was one of the most memorable days of my life, actually, because being able to sign and get that on paper and just be committed with a group of guys and coming to an organization that's bigger than yourself is special. And it's been a dream of mine since I was little, ever since I started playing. And it feels good to put that down on paper and be able to say that I've committed and it's official now. Signing day was a special day. I was comfortable with the coaches. Coach Mendenhall came in and he left his mark very fast and I saw what kind of coach he was and the type of man he had on his staff and it was a place I really wanted to be. Everybody that came in, we all have that kind of bond so it's really just nice to experience these moments with them. When I was out there, I looked to my right, I see Jordan Mack, I look to my left, I see Bryce Hall at corner, I look back, Chris Moore's at safety and it's kind of, it's kind of real cool seeing all your boys who you struggled with over the summer out on the field getting theirs and showing what they can do. I feel proud to be a part of it. It's a great represent representation for the freshman class. My favorite memory has to be the first game of the season, walking out of the tunnel and just seeing the crowd and all the hype atmosphere. That was one of the coolest things I've ever experienced. The Duke game was a special game because the defense was clicking, everyone was doing their assignments to the best of their ability. And as you can see, it was different things and plays being made because every person did their job that allowed a special play to happen. I think probably the first play I got in against UNC, I wasn't expecting it at all. I was real nervous, I didn't really know exactly what to do. It was my first college game, first defensive play. But after, after the first play or two, I was just in my zone, I was ready to go. It was insane, it was awesome. Word Hall and Mack are three members of the 2016 class that were able to make big contributions on the field for the Cavaliers. The trio didn't expect this to happen when they stepped foot on grounds, especially given the talent at their positions. Originally going into the season, I didn't expect to really see the field much, so I was just trying to be as prepared as possible going into it. Leading up to that Duke week, we had a couple guys down and I knew I had a shot to see some time. So I prepared extra hard and I was able to go out and have a successful game. And then from then on, I just kept improving and building through practice. I honestly didn't know what to expect too much. When I first came in, I was struggling, so I didn't think I'd play very much. But as it kept going, I felt more comfortable and more confident that I would eventually get playing time. And eventually I got my shot, and I thought I did a pretty, pretty good job at showing the coaching staff what I have to offer. My expectations coming in was basically learn the system very fast, attach myself to an older guy, and just learn as much as I can, be a sponge and soak up, whether it be in the film room or the playbook, just spend an entire first year just learning the process and how to be a college student athlete. And when Malcolm went down, that was unfortunate so that when I was thrust in that position, everything moved so fast that I really didn't have time to think about it. It was just more of, you know, this is what I came here for and it's my opportunity. So I just have to step up and do my best for my team. The coaches, they don't see age as a limiting factor in you seeing the field. They really care about who's the best guy for this position. And at any given time, you can be thrust in the fire. And if you prepare well, then you can really make a difference on this team. Putting in the effort to earn playing time is the goal of every new Cavalier, including the members of the 2017 Virginia football recruiting class. I'll tell them that it's going to be tough, but you got a, a brotherhood that's with you and it's going to push you through and it's all worth it in the long run. They need to come in ready. They need to come in ready to work. They need to come in ready to play because there's going to be a lot of guys in the, their first class that are going to get playing time and that are going to be needed on special teams, defense, offense, whatever it needs to be. They need to come in ready to do extra and just ready to go because we need guys that will help this program and I think what I've seen so far from their class 
they got the guys that we need, and I'm excited to see what they can do.